Hello, welcome to another episode of Home Cooking with Susan Jung. Today we're going to be making kimchi pancakes. All you need is flour, potato flour or potato starch, an egg, a bit of salt, kimchi obviously, and tofu. For this we're also going to use spring onions and banana chilies. For the sauce, you need soy sauce, rice wine, rice wine vinegar, sesame oil, the sesame seeds which we've toasted already, and a little bit of chili powder. So in the bowl we have some flour, we'll add some potato starch, salt, and We'll whisk the egg with water. Now ideally you'll make the batter an hour or so in advance. I've made this one earlier and you can see how the starch has absorbed some of the liquid so it's not as watery compared to this one. We'll add in some tofu. I've drained it so that it's, it will be less watery. And kimchi, which I've also drained. And I'll chop it up. Now for this, you want to use old kimchi. Uh, if you use fresh kimchi, it, it has less flavor. And now I'm mixing the ingredients together. As you can see, everything is quite small, which is good. So we'll cut up the spring onions into short lengths. And the chilies will cut on that diagonal. So we'll heat the pan and add a bit of oil. So when the pan is hot enough, you just ladle in some of the mixture. And you want to stir every time you ladle because the heavy stuff will sink to the bottom. And you add some of the other ingredients. As you can see, around the perimeter of, of each pancake, it starts to set and dry out. That's when you know when it's ready to flip. You want to adjust the heat so that the exterior browns enough while the interior gets cooked. Now for the sauce, it needs equal parts of soy sauce, rice wine, and rice vinegar, and a little bit of sesame oil. Then you add the toasted sesame seeds and some chili powder. And there you have it, Korean kimchi pancakes.